If you are looking for the best forex brokers in Denmark, look no further. In this video I'm going to show you my top 5 picks and why they are the best. Hey, welcome back, it's Yuri Safrono, aka Professor Forex. I have a PhD degree in finance and I teach hundreds of students every year. In this video I'm going to show you my top 5 picks for the best regulated forex brokers in Denmark. I have evaluated them on 5 points. Regulation, trading platform, trading instruments offering, trading fees and customer support. Now, if you are like me, you want to make sure that you are working with a reputable and reliable broker who can give you the best trading experience possible. So whether you are just starting out or you are an experienced trader, these brokers will have something for everyone. All the brokers I choose are regulated and licensed by world's renowned regulatory authorities. It's important that your broker is regulated by a reputable regulatory authority and registered under DFSA – Danish Financial Supervisory Authority – if you trade in Denmark. Now let's start with the list. Please note that it's a randomized list and that the first or last broker on this list is not better than the other one. In the list of the best forex brokers in Denmark, PLUS500 is the first one. PLUS500 is a forex CFDs trading broker and that is holding under the name of PLUS500 Limited. Let's find out how PLUS500 is regulated. PLUS500 is regulated by different reputable regulatory authorities around the world. In particular, in Denmark, PLUS500 CY Limited is registered under Danish Financial Supervisory Authority. In the United Kingdom, PLUS500 UK is authorized and regulated by the FCA. In Cyprus, PLUS500 CY Limited is authorized and regulated by CISIC. What are the trading platforms offered by PLUS500? PLUS500 uses a proprietary trading platform, it's acceptable from any browser, you can also download the desktop version on your PC or laptop, they don't have MT4 or MT5, but they have Android and iOS apps. What can we trade on PLUS500? PLUS500 offers 60 currency pairs, 14 cryptocurrencies, most popular indexes, commodities, popular shares, options and ETFs. Spreads of PLUS500 vary depending on the instruments you are trading. Leverage varies from 1 to 2 for cryptos to 1 to 30 for Forex. PLUS500 has kept it simple and offers its clients the choice of a standard trading account and a demo account. Let's move to the fees and commissions of PLUS500. PLUS500 doesn't have any trading fees. They make money by spreads and swaps. But they have an inactivity fee of $10 per month if your account is inactive for 3 months. Minimum deposit is $100. Depending on withdrawal methods, they have different withdrawal limits. You will find it on the withdrawal screen of PLUS500 platform. Lastly, how is PLUS500 customer support is like? The platform offers 24 hours a day, 7 days a week support via email and chart. You will find an answer to most questions via the FAQ section, however, if a client cannot find the query in the FAQ, then they can start an online chart. PLUS500 trading app offers support in 32 languages. If you want to give it a try with PLUS500, you can use the link in the description to open a live trading account. Our next broker is Dukas Copy. Dukas Copy Bank SA was established in 1998 and provides bank and online trading services in different countries. Dukas Copy Europe IBS AS provides its services for Danish traders. Let's start with Dukas Copy regulation. Dukas Copy Europe IBS AS is registered under DFSA. It's licensed and regulated by different reputable regulatory authorities around the world. In particular, in Switzerland, Dukas Copy Bank is regulated by the Swiss Financial Market Supervisory Authority. In the EU, Dukas Copy is also regulated by the European Union Markets in Financial Instruments Directive.
In Latvia, Dukaskopi Europe IBS AS is an EU licensed investment brokerage company based in Riga, Latvia. Uh, regulated by the Financial and Capital Market Commission of Latvia. Let's find out details about Dukaskopi trading platforms. The most popular platform uh, from Dukescopy is JForex. It's a web-based and desktop platform that runs on Windows and Mac. Dukescopy also offers iPhone, iPad and Android applications. Some Forex traders prefer MetaTrader 4, which is why they also work with MetaTrader 4. JForex Dukescopy is packed with trading tools and is simple to use. It's ideal for traders who trade in technical areas with tools of drawing and uh, more than 300 indicators to help with technical trading as the addition to ability to import of customized indicator. Uh, what can you trade with Dukescopy in Denmark? Dukescopy in Denmark currently offers over 120 currencies with attractive spreads. The broker also offers CFDs on stocks, commodities, bonds, indexes and ETFs such as Eurostox 50 and Dow Jones among other things. The broker offers CFDs on binary options. Dukescopy also offers banking services to its clients. For Forex traders, Dukescopy offers two types of live accounts. Forex ECN account and Forex MT4 account. Average spreads for most currencies like EURUSD are approximately 0.3-0.4 pips. Maximum leverage for Forex trading is 1 to 200. Now let's move to fees and commissions of Dukescopy. Account opening and closing fee is zero. Account maintenance fee is zero to 0.5%. The gold custody cost 1% of the yearly balance. The fee for changing the address of the blockchain wallet is $50. Foreign currency char charge is 0.05% to 1% based on the value of currency that is converted. Deposit fees for bank transfers are free. Payment by European cards cost 1.5%, 2.5% for cards that are non-European. Apple Pay and Skrill fees is 2.5%, uh, fee for Neteller is $1 or 2.5%, Bitcoins, other Tether deposits are completely free. When withdrawing money, uh, the fee for bank transfer is different based on the currencies. The fee for crypto transfer is $50 or 0.5% from your amount, whichever is greater. Lastly, let's find out how Dukescopy customer support is working. Dukescopy customer support is helpful. And there are many ways to get in touch with them. You can contact them via their website live chart. You can also make the request to call you back or submit a query on the website, which is working uh, 24 hours a day, 5 days a week. They have phone numbers for different physical offices uh, where you can call to get your issues solved. If you want to try Dukescopy, uh, find the account opening link in the description below. Third broker we will talk about is XTB. The company has its headquarters in Warsaw, Poland. Established back in 2005, this broker has offices in 13 countries such as the UK, Poland, Germany, France, UAE and Chile. XTB Limited provides broker services in Denmark. Let's find out how XTB is regulated. XTB Limited is registered under Danish Financial Supervisory Authority in Denmark and is regulated by other reputable regulatory authorities in Europe. In particular, in the United Kingdom, XTB is regulated by the UK Financial Conduct Authority. In the EU, XTB Limited is authorized and regulated by the Cyprus Securities and Exchange Commission. Let's see what are the trading platforms of XTB. XTB offers a proprietary platform named XStation. The platform has web version, desktop, Android, iOS, tablet version as well. There are a myriad of tools for analysis of technical data available on the platform. You can find 24-7 drawing tools as well as 
37 technical indicators. What can we trade with XTB? XTB offers 1,849 CFDs on stocks, 138 ETFs, 23 commodities, 36 indexes, 5 cryptocurrencies and 57 forex pairs. The spread for currency pairs start from 0.1 pip and they provide 1 to 30 leverage for forex pairs. The available account types at XTB are Standard Account, Swap Account, Professional Account and Demo Account. Now what about the costs and fees of XTB? XTB average spread on EURUSD is 0.9 pips and the minimum deposit is 250 euro. There are no fees for depositing and you can make deposits through bank wire, credit card or debit cards. However, if you deposit through Skrill on a teller, they charge 2% fee for Skrill and 1% for Neteller deposits. For withdrawals, XTB doesn't charge any fees if the amount is above 60 euro. The final point is about XTB's customer support, which is available 24-5 and also through phone, email, online chart. If you need a quick reply, you can use their online chart. If you are interested in this broker, you can create an account using the link in the description below. Next in the list is eToro. eToro is a social trading platform that has been customized for Denmark and European traders. The company has 10 million users, it's an easy to get started thanks to their customly built interface. Let's find out how eToro is regulated. eToro Europe is registered under Danish Financial Supervisory Authority and is regulated by the following regulatory authorities. In Europe, eToro Europe is regulated by the Cyprus Securities and Exchange Commission. In the United Kingdom, eToro UK Limited is authorized and regulated by the Financial Conduct Authority or FCA. What can we trade with eToro? The broker offers 49 currency pairs, 32 commodities, 13 indexes, 2,711 stocks, 264 ETFs and 51 cryptocurrencies. Next, what are the trading platforms eToro offers? What's interesting is that they don't have MetaTrader 4 or MetaTrader 5, but instead eToro has built their own user-friendly trading platform, which is available through the web platform and mobile app. Besides the trading platform, eToro offer trading tools, one of which is Traders Copy, where you can find the best traders and just copy their trades without having the need of years of trading knowledge. Now what are the costs and fees of eToro? If you want to start trading with eToro, the minimum deposit varies between 10 euro to 200 euro depending on what trading account and pairs you will trade in. In terms of deposit fees, eToro doesn't charge uh, anything, but the withdrawal fee is $5. When looking at their spreads, it starts from 1 pip. In Denmark, they provide 1 to 30 leverage for major forex pairs. Last point about eToro is their customer support. Is it any good? I checked with them and I found that their customer support is good enough and responded fast. They are available through email, phone, callback service and live web chart. If you want to give it a try with eToro, you can use the link in the description below to open a live trading account. Finally, we are going to talk about Forex Time or FXTM. Forex Time is a Forex broker established back in 2011 by Andrei Dashin. Let's find out how FXTM is regulated. FXTM Limited is registered under Danish Financial Supervisory Authority and also regulated by different reputable regulatory authorities in Europe. In Cyprus, Forex Time Limited is regulated by SISIC. In the United Kingdom, Forex Time UK Limited is regulated by the FCA. 
Next, let's move to FXTM trading platforms. FXTM provides MetaTrader 4 and MetaTrader 5 trading platforms for their customers. With FXTM, MetaTrader 4 and MetaTrader 5 are available on Windows and Mac systems and on iOS and Android mobile devices. They also have proprietary mobile app named FXTM Trader. With FXTM Trader, you can take advantage of the broker's copy trading service in FXTM Invest. What can we trade with FXTM in Denmark? In Denmark, traders can get access to over 1000 trading instruments. FXTM offers forex, metals, stocks, commodities and indexes. They offer four types of accounts in Denmark. Micro account, Advantage account, Advantage Plus account and Demo account. For Forex trading in Denmark, they offer 1 to 1000 leverage for micro accounts and 1 to 2000 for Advantage and Advantage Plus accounts. Let's find out the fees and commissions of FXTM. In Denmark, deposit to FXTM is free. For withdrawals, though, e-wallet uh, is free, but with credit card, you will be charged a fee. Minimum deposit in FXTM is $10. Micro and Advantage Plus accounts do not have any commissions. But the Advantage account commission ranging on average from €0.40 Euro cents to €2 Euros per 100,000 uh, nominal value. FXTM spreads start from 0 pips. The final point of FXTM is its customer support. FXTM customer support includes a comprehensive FAQ section, which you can use to answer a few questions before contacting the support team. Danish traders can also email them, call them or do live chart on FXTM website to resolve their issues. If you want to give it a try with FXTM, you can use the link below in the description to open a live account. We've completed the list of the top 5 Forex brokers in Denmark. For more great platforms that are available to those who live in Denmark, check out our website a2zmarkets.com and find some others on this list too. I hope you enjoy our videos. Don't forget to give us a like and subscribe to the channel and press that bell button for notifications. And do share with your friends who are looking for some great insights about Forex and other financial markets. Thank you so much!